Welcome to Giggles Read Aloud. Subscribe to Giggles for more videos. Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Dog Days by Jeff Kenny, Part 2 Saturday, like I said, mom keeps trying to get me to go to the pool with her and my little brother Manny. But the thing is, my family belongs to town pool, not the country club. And once you've tasted the country club life, it's hard to go back to being an ordinary Joe at the town pool. Besides, last year I swore to myself that I would never go back to that place again. At town pool, you have to go through the locker room before you can go swimming. And that means walking through the shower area where grown men are soaping down right out in the open. The first time I walked through the men's locker room at the town pool was one of the most traumatic experiences of my life. I'm probably lucky. I didn't go blind. Seriously, I don't see why mom and dad bother and try to protect me from horror movies and stuff like that if they're gonna expose me to something out a thousand times worse. I really wish mom would stop asking me to go to the town pool because every time she does, it puts an image in my mind that I've been trying hard to forget. Sunday. Well, now I'm definitely staying indoors for the rest of the summer. Mom had a house meeting last night and said money is tight this year and we can't afford to go to the beach which means no family vacations. That really stinks. I was actually looking forward to going to the beach this summer. Not because I like the ocean and the sand and all of that, because I don't. I realized a long time ago that all the world's fish and turtles and whales go to the bathroom right there in the ocean. And I seem to be the only person who's bothered by this. My brother Roderick likes to tease me because he thinks I'm afraid of the waves. But I'm telling you, that's not it at all. Anyway, I was looking forward to going to the beach because I'm finally tall enough to go onto the cranium shaker, which is this really awesome ride that's on the broadwalk. Roderick's been on the cranium shaker at least a hundred times, and he says, you can't call yourself a man until you ride it. <laughs>